Hey, and welcome back to the second instalment of T.O.E.G. I feel like that rolls off the tongue quite nicely, but uh, yeah, obviously last episode, we got the Ranger Boots. That is going to make a huge difference to our cash stack. Um, so that is excellent, but this episode, I'm mostly going to be focused on trying to get the Quest Cape. It's something I've always wanted in RuneScape, but never got. So there's a couple of uh, quests that I am not looking forward to, so wish me luck. Also to this person, you are the lucky winner of the bond, so I've had a new game and you've not been in line yet, but uh, yeah, hit me up and you can claim your bond. Okay, so I've decided I am very close to getting the quest cape, so I'm going to start walking, walking, working towards getting that done. Uh, Dragon Slayer 2 is the only quest, I'm a little bit... Um, Unsure how that's gonna go. Um, I've heard the rest are pretty easy, so I'm just gonna smash them out now quick and uh, well make a start on them. I'm not gonna promise anything, but I'm gonna try and get it done. Okay, and that's the first quest done. That literally took like two minutes, and we get a beginner clue scroll. I'm gonna start banking these and maybe wait until I've got a few of these, and definitely stick that in room crafting because I hate room crafting. It's only 300 XP, so. Never mind. Right, let's go have a look at maybe another quest. There we go, another quest done, the Ancient of Atticus. And a little bit of XP from that. Uh, okay, I don't want to talk to you anymore. Four more quests to go. I'm definitely going to do the Forsaken Tower next. That's a fairly quick quest, I think. So, yeah, that'll be the next thing popping up. Yes, there we go. Forsaken Tower is completed. That's leaving just three quests left. I don't know if I'm going to do them all now, but I might make a start on um, making friends with my arm, which is going to be cool. And also, this is the very, uh, oops, the last page for the memoirs. So if we reminisce this now, we've unlocked all of them. I need this for the diaries at some point, which um, is something I need to work on. There's so much I need to do on this account. It is unreal. But, uh, yeah, hopefully we'll get it all done fairly soon. Another quest bites the dust. That is my arm. That was really easy. I barely used any food as well, so uh, it's a lot easier with better gear than what I did in the hardcore. Some decent XP, disease-free patch, and ability to mine the sulfur ore thingamabobbies. So I'll probably do that at some point for the teleports and also for the... Uh, the pits that are around RuneScape, I think there's four of them to do or something, so uh, yeah, that was quite an easy one done. I don't know if I'm going to do some mining now and then uh, carry on with the last two quests or what. I don't know what I'm going to do now. There's so much to do. There we go, Fremnic Isles is done. 15,000 Slayer, 5,000 Runecrafting, which is beautiful, and some crafting XP. So we'll just close this off. Any levels? No. Okay, rip. We have only got one more quest left, and it's Dragon Slayer 2. I probably am not going to do it today. It's quite late right now, and uh, I've kind of had enough of questing. So uh, I might go do something else for a bit, but I don't know what. But um, yeah, that's a good quest to get done. I need to unlock the Basilisk at some point in case I ever get the jaw, because that'd be cool. I was meant to record it, but I kind of forgot, but uh, yeah, I just did my first ever Volkaf kill, and uh, it didn't go that great, to be honest. I used a lot of supplies, but uh, I feel a lot more comfortable with the mechanics of how it works, and I also did use a um, pretty decent setup for it, so um, yeah, it wasn't too bad. Uh, I'm kind of looking forward to doing Volkaf in the future. Okay, so this is it. I am just about to attempt the boss, and this is my setup. So this is the bruising equipment I am bringing. Um, I think I am well ready for it. Hopefully we'll do it first time. Uh, we'll see. <laughs>
Okay, so as you can see, that went terribly. I was not prepared for Galvanic at all, but let's try again. Oh, I missed the last end of it, but there we go. Galvec is dead. This is my second attempt, to be honest. Um, I had really crappy gear and I just couldn't get the DPS, so I upgraded a little bit and uh, yeah, it wasn't too bad at all to do. I kind of uh, kind of enjoyed it in the end. Right, let's go finish off the rest of this quest. Um, I don't know how much more I've got to do or what I've got to do, but I imagine it's nearly dead. Also, spoiler, this was a very sad part. There we go! Dragon Slayer 2 has been done. I am so pleased to have this quest done. You get a ton of XP and all sorts. Any levels to follow? 74 smithing. Uh, do dart tips, so that is pretty cool. And that is the only thing right now. Um, yeah, so that's that's kind of major. That's all the quests done. I need to look into getting the uh, quest cape. But I'm going to go have a quick look in here because um, I want to buy the myth capes for, for any time I want to teleport here and I probably need coins for that and I haven't got any so uh, yeah I'm just gonna have a quick look around and then we'll go look at getting the quest cape. Hey I found it there we go that is the mythical cape so that just teleports us right to the center of here and um, it's uh, it's just an easy teleport for if I ever need to come here for going to kill dragons or whatever it is I'm going to do on my adventures right let's start looking into getting the quest cape. Okay, so oh, we don't kill the uh, rat. We talked to the wise old man about the quest point cape. 99,000. Uh, yes, there we go. Have fun with it. I will indeed. So let's put this bad boy on and uh, maybe come out here. Scroll down and do the emote. We have to do the emote because, I mean... Oh, I've never owned this cape the whole entire time playing RuneScape, and it is, uh, I'd say it's quite a big achievement to get something like this. It's uh, many hours of questing for this cape, and it does come with a handyish teleport, so we're just going to teleport now that we've stopped doing the emote, and we're directly right next to a fairy ring, which is really good. Obviously, uh, it makes just teleporting around the map a little bit quicker than having to use the Slayer Ring all the time. So, now I have to figure out what I'm doing next. Okay, so that is it. I finally have this cape, and uh, yeah, it feels pretty damn good to finally have this thing. I've always wanted to have this uh, cape pretty much uh, since back in the days, and uh, yeah, it's so great being able to finally say that I have the cape. But uh, yes, hopefully you enjoyed this episode, and uh, if you did, don't forget to uh, comment and let me know. And uh, don't forget to subscribe either, because uh, that's very nice to see. And um, you'll also then be notified for the next episode. So I'll see you then. Cheers.